Hi, Messy Church. It's great to be able to talk to you today, even though we can't see you. And I brought Barnabas with me today because he's going to help us with today's story, aren't you? You didn't like it? What didn't you like about it? You had to be really sad. I know, it was a bit of a sad story, but maybe the ending was a bit better. You like the ending? Okay. So we're going to think about what happened to some of Jesus' friends after he died and rose again. You remember that Mary looked in the tomb and he wasn't there. So let's see what happened to his friends. And we're going to think about some things to do with that story. And we're going to have some fun and we're going to make some mess. That's right. So we hope you enjoy Messy Church today and we look forward to seeing you again soon. Bye. So on the same day that Mary found the tomb was empty, some of Jesus' friends hid away in Jerusalem, but others decided they might as well go home. And so it was that two of his followers were found on the road to Emmaus. They were walking along, looking really sad as they chatted to each other. And after a while, they found that there was a third person with them. And he met them and said, what's the matter? Why are you so sad? And they said, well, haven't you heard what's been happening in Jerusalem? And so he walked along with them and they talked and he told them lots of things about what, what, what was going on, what had happened. And eventually they got to their home and they invited him in for something to eat. And it was while he broke the bread sitting with them that they recognised him and then he disappeared. As they sat down to eat, Jesus took the bread and he broke it. And then his followers realised who it was they'd been walking with. 